Hi everyone and welcome back to the channel. I have got here my uh, Spitfire Mark 1. Um, this was originally built in 1973 which I got um, which I basically stripped and I'm refurbishing it. Uh, so th this wasn't originally built by me um, however I have stripped it down completely and I'm currently in the process of rebuilding it. So what I'm doing today is I'm going to be painting on the roundels using a mask from Montex. So I bought this a few months ago. Uh, I think it was about eight or nine quid from uh, Hannans. Uh, that's a, uh, a model shop in the UK. So this is the version I'm doing. It's the Mark One. So this is the colours I've done. Now I've already painted this anyway, as you can see. I've got to touch up the uh, underside because it's not quite 100% uh, right. Um, but yeah, I'm going to be painting the roundels um, today. Now I've already masked everything up off camera which makes it a lot easier and a lot quicker and you guys don't have to sit through and watch it. So these vinyl masks, I'm sure they're vinyl, um, they're pre-cut and they're really really easy to apply. So they stick to the model really well but peel off really really easily. Now I don't know if that's coming across on camera, you can see the little lines but it is, you can see the shape of the roundel in there. Now I've left the centre um, unmasked, because I'm going to paint that first. I've also masked the tail plane, so I'm going to do that one first as well. So these are the same colour. So I'm going to do both sides, both tail and centre roundel. I'm using the same colour as this. Uh, so this was a custom mix I made and it's it's gone down really well. So let's get that loaded up into the brush. We'll go from there. Right so we're on to the last roundel now. We've got the uh, yellow into the um, into the paint cup. So I'm just going to get that one sprayed. And there we go. Right, so that should have dried nicely. Now here comes the good bit. I'm going to remove all of the masking and see how this looks. Now, obviously I've not seen this yet, so... Yeah.
we go. There's the tail plate. I think that looks quite good. Right. And then the roundels. That looks absolutely brilliant. I'm really happy with that. Let's get the other side done. There we go. That looks better than any decal I've ever put on. Yeah, I'm really, really happy with that. So that's the results using the Montex um, decal masks. So this is a 124th uh, Spitfire Mark 1. Use these masks. You get all the instructions with it, as I've already mentioned. So that's when the light works properly. That's what you expect to get, and that's what I've got. I'm really, really pleased with this. Well worth eight quid. I think it looks absolutely brilliant. What do you guys think? Thanks for watching.